This country, Nigeria, is blessed with natural sprinters. We just need encouragement from the government. Lagos, one of many homes to over 2,000 track and field athletes training every day to represent the great nation Nigeria, home and abroad. Athletics, like many structures in Nigeria, is riddled with corruption, abuse, and constant embezzlement of funds. Athletes who must achieve their goals oftentimes have to do so from outside the shores of the country. But what happens to those who are unable to leave? to police college Ikeja. I've been told that a good number of athletes gather there to train or coach young talents. Hopefully I find past or present athletes who will be willing to share their experiences representing Nigeria. Here is Femi, a promising athlete cut short in his prime by a treatable injury. And here is what he had to say about athletics in Nigeria. Like the athletes that we have in Nigeria, what are the competitions that they go for? We don't have much competition in Nigeria. We only have the Golden League, okay. Upcomers, those that are being organized by the AFN, okay. the Athletics okay. Federation, Federation of, of Nigeria. Nigeria. And it's once a while. We have the Mobin, okay. that's the final, the mother of the athletics competition in Nigeria. Mm -hmm. I don't know if it's still in existence. Okay. But well, I know we have those stuff in those days. These days there is less or nothing, no competition Why is in that? Nigeria. I don't they know, don't maybe you ask the sports minister. Mm -hmm. And without competition, there is no way you can improve yeah. or know your strength. Yes. So, so how do the athletes that we now send for like those Olympics and the rest, how did they now train? How did they get ready? 90% are foreign athletes. If okay. you check, you will see most of the ones that are performing well, well they're, they're all based abroad, so it's not encouraging. For you now, like your, with your career with athletics now, what was like the stages that you passed and like, how, what was it like? And why did you stop? When I started, it was fun. Okay. I was training well. I participated in those leagues. But what I noticed is that we don't have a we don't have facilities and equipment for you to get to your your peak. And we need more experienced coach, coaches around. We need a lot of things. We have a long way to go. These days, you need to go abroad for you to be a star in your country. Why? Things have really gotten sour. You will be surprised that there are no, there are no common starting block. There is what we call starting block, where you place your leg. Yes, I know what I'm saying. Athletes don't have it. How do an athlete that want to go for, for international competition, I want to compete with international athlete will not even know how to use a starting okay. block. All That's your trainings and everything, you sponsor it. I've never had support from anybody when I was wow. doing it. And that wow. is the reason why I have to stop early. Because I, I think at my age, my mates are still competing in the Olympics. But I'm injured. There are no doctors. I have to put that here. Yeah. No doctors. No good doctors. Let's assume you have only two injuries. The athletes, of, the athletes and injury, they are causes. There's no how you'll be an athlete that will not sustain one or two injuries in the process. It might not be physical injury. It might be muscle strain, calf pain that you get from sport. But you need good physiotherapist and all little things to correct those pain. But if you don't have those, you just go for painkiller that will subside the pain. After some while, you will come back instead of food therapy that will bring you back to So that's, those are my own experience. Mm, I'm still suffering from injury that I got through athletics because there are no good doctors to put you to when you have injury to help you.
what's it like being an athlete in Nigeria? Oh wow, and tell us some kind of struggle right now because our country is far behind in terms of sports and activities. So I think it's a struggle for most athletes in Nigeria. Yeah. What do you think can be done better? So I feel for me, I think they should assess the athletes know their welfare, follow up and do the best thing for them. With your training, do you like sponsor yourself or the government helps or how do you, what's the sponsorship like? Oh wow, right now, just my parents. Just your parents? And myself, but no sponsor, nothing from the government, but we hope.